we are out here with our Flybear SU-35 little two-channel micro park jet. And I haven't flown this in a long time, so I thought I'd come out here and play around with it a little bit. Let's get it in the air. There it goes. Now remember the key to flying these little two channel micros like this is to, when you make your turn, you want to just nudge it, nudge it, nudge it. If you, if you try to fly it like a, a you know, normal RC plane, since it uses the two motors for differential thrust, what you'll have, what will happen is it will really dip a wing and nose down. So. Give it a little bit of throttle when you're making your turn. Sorry about the sun. <laughs> I haven't flown this in a long time. But it is a fun little plane. See if I can make it back over here without dipping it down too much. There we go. <laughs> These are, this is a, a cool little trainer plane for a kid. Or a you know, fun little toy for a, an adult, because I have a lot of fun with it. Takes a little bit of throttle management. Flies pretty slow. If we can bring it in a little bit closer here. There we go. Nudge. Nudge, 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 nudge. <laughs> Have a fun little plane. That yellow and black color scheme, that killer bee color scheme really makes it visible in the air. close one. I, I laid off the throttle. It's, I still need it to climb. Um, I laid off the throttle a little bit too long there. I would say that was about three or four inches from touching the ground. So yeah, my, I need to practice my throttle management a bit again. Oh, plus I'm going downwind right there too. So there's about a three or four mile an hour wind this morning. It's not that bad, but um, I got to remember to throttle it up a little bit. Going downwind, going upwind now. All right, throttle up. <laughs> I think I forgot to set my timer. I was going to fly it for about four minutes. Uh, let's see. Let's do a couple more circuits here. Coming into the wind. Isn't that cool? Throttle up going downwind. Now cut off the throttle a little bit.
So it come out. And then it well worth the money. I think I paid mm, somewhere between twenty five and twenty six dollars for it. I've already gotten a lot more fun out of this plane than what I paid for it. Into the sun, gas up going downwind. Now you notice that this is not doing a lot of that porpoising like most of those fly bear planes and every one that I have tested so far, there's been three of them. The Red Baron plane, uh, the F-16, and this one, and every one of them has been tail heavy. So, um, I will put links in the show notes to the review and the nose weight testing that I did on this, because it definitely has a sweet spot, you know, to where it's gonna fly pretty straight and level and it's so light, you know, it is um, CG sensitive. So, but every, every one of those fly bear planes has required a little bit of nose weight. And I have a dime glued into this, into the nose of this one. Oh, I almost let off the throttle a little bit too much again. Whoa! <laughs> that was... That was a close one. You got to remember to uh, give it some more throttle when you're going downwind and, and you know, when you're turning because it does lose some lift. Now we're coming, now we're coming into the wind. Too much fun. And remember that when you turn, you just, you just want to nudge it, nudge it, nudge it. You don't want to. You don't want to push the stick in either direction and hold it there because it will dive. Alright, now we're getting ready to turn it back into the wind. Gas it up. Going downwind now. Nudge, nudge, nudge. Cut back on the throttle. Not too much. Gas it up. <laughs> isn't that, isn't that a cool little plane? Two little tiny brushed motors doing a differential thrust to make it turn. And that, there are no control surfaces on this plane at all. It's just all done with differential thrust and throttle management. So it will teach you good throttle management, I have to say that, for one of these little micro planes. Into the wind, crabbing a little bit. Ooh, did you see that? <laughs> that was another uh, near touch and go. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, complete this circuit, and then I'm gonna. I think the wind shifted on me. I'm gonna pl complete the circuit, and I'll bring it in for a landing. But yeah, this thing is too much fun. I have a blast with it. I think my, I think yeah, I think the batteries are coming down a little bit. Oh, I did catch it. <laughs> anyway, that is a fun little plane and you will get a lot more fun out of it than what it costs. So I call that a good value. And I will put a link to the plane in the show notes as well as the previous uh, review and um, my nose weight testing and where I found the sweet spot on this little guy. But thanks for watching. Please give a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to check out our Patreon site. We have a lot of free content there as well. And I will see you in the air.